welcome um ladies and gentlemen Taurus says this is um the month of may wow congratulations Taurus says um the first two weeks of may it is yours all right what do we come in the knight of swords information is is going to be coming out Taurus says. so you're entering this period where a lot of information a whole lot of information is coming out now um, and it's as if a whole lot of you are going to be in meetings, a whole lot of you communication is going to be the key. Whatever is transpiring in business and work, you got to communicate and expect some sort of a harsh communication could be coming to some of you Tauruses. OK, whenever this energy is in reverse, it can be harsh communication that is going to be coming um, to you. So when we enter enter um, um, a period, a four weeks period um, with this harsh communication, I see whatever is coming in at you entering this four weeks period, you have to resolve it. You're going to be balance it and resolve it because in the foundation, what we see is the energy of the four of cups. And this is some sort of an offer is going to be coming to some of you Tauruses. And it's as if they're saying, oh, Taurus is we see that you have a whole lot of uh, work to do and you're not getting off what we need. So we're going to be getting in an assistant. That's sort of a thing that is of communication. So whatever is happening and transpiring, this communication that is coming in, I see um, is as if they're going to be saying, hey, Taurus, is, can you do the job or not? Or should we get someone to come in and help? So some sort of a transition is going to be happening. Then we have the five of cups. So we have debt. We have the five of cups and we have the four of cups. So there is going to be emotions. Um, there's a whole lot of emotions that is going to be coming up and transpiring. And you're receiving this harsh communication. And we all know that it's something very emotion. And we have the wheel of uh, um, uh, the wheel of fortune. These are new. I love these ones, and that's why I use it for the the uh, singer. So we have. Let's look together. We the wheel of fortune. Okay, the wheel of fortune. So the wheel of fortune is in the first week, and it's as if something is going to be coming back or um uh, up that you have to deal with some sort of a um problems that you have not resolved and it's as if manager is just calling him up and say hey Taurus is we got to get this resolved because you know we have been putting this off we got to get this resolved so in the first week there is some it's as if your boss is pulling on your string and said hey we got to get this resolved the situation needs to be resolved we got to make a decision what we're going to be doing moving forward Okay, so in the second week, expect that this information is going to be coming up. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been saying to a lot of people, um, readings or you got to be quick and good so that people can remember. Follow us, become a member. It's a dollar ninety nine to see the extras of these reading. And in the archive, you're not only seeing this reading, you can accelerate and access thousands of reading that is already in the archive okay one amount a dollar 99 can help you to find out what is coming up in the future you will be pushed and drawn to a reading that there is something at the workplace that you should know or there's something that is going on in your business that you should know and that is how it helps you a dollar 99 is nothing you buy a cup of coffee for more than that so ladies and gentlemen check out what is going on by um, um applying and joining it's just a lot of dollar ninety nine per month. How much is that per year? And you are getting solid good information that is going to be ha helping a whole lot of you. So you know these are quick. These are fifteen minutes. They're quick, but the extended is there. So going back to the reading, what we're recognizing is that a lot of you Tauruses, they're going to be pulling on the string and say, "Hey Tauruses, we need to get this done." So expect the first week is that something that you Taurus that need to finish. So that um, you can move forward. Then we see the energy of the five of cups. And I see a lot of you Tauruses recognize that some sort of a changes is coming in. But I think you're open for this changes because it's as if a lot of you Taurus has been down with a whole lot of work and has been leaving the office very late, up early, full time. And they're going to be saying, hey, in the second week, hey, 
um, you know, Taurus is you have a whole lot of workload. Should we get a temp in here or should we ask someone else to come and help you Taurus is out? And I see you're going to be happy, happily for this changes. So, at the, at, you know, in the, um, and the, the, the crowning of this reading is transition. Transition is coming up for a lot of you at the workplace and for a lot of you in business. And it's going to be a welcome transition that you have been hoping for. So if you're a tourist that has been out of work or has been waiting for some sort of a resolution at your company, uh, it is going to be coming in and I see you're going to be really um, accepting this as a welcome relief. OK, you're really going to be accessing this as a welcome relief. Um, then we see this energy of a tower moment, a tower moment. And um, this tower moment, um, the, you were aware because in the second week you recognize that something is about to change. Something is about to happen. And there is definitely going to be a tower moment. And what is it going to be affecting? It's going to be affecting um, some sort of an emotional situation where a lot of you were like, I had so much to do. I, I don't, I can't get this off. And, you know, this tower moment is going to be rec helping you to recognize that, hey, help is here if you only ask for the help. And some of you could have asked for the help and you recognize. So the transition is coming in with a tower moment, but it's not um, a blast. The tower is in reverse. So it's as if uh, a lot of you had too much on your plate and was dealing with too much. And then manager kind of recognized that, hey, Taurus is, is, is a little full. So they're going to be bringing in some help. Now, a tower moment could be coming down for um, a... Uh, scorpion whoever the scorpion is and whatever is transpiring um uh, it could be that a scorpion was your sight your you know someone who was helping you out um you know they was removed or you have to tell a, a, um, a scorpion that they're going to be fired so some of you you might have to be um bringing some bad news um to a scorpion and letting a scorpion know that they could be fired or they're going to be letting them go and it has art for you and i see a lot of you're going to be trying to really make sure that this person either gets a new job or either gets some sort of a positive feedback in order to remove in that job position so there is something circling a scorpion there is some sort of a transition that is here for a scorpion and you tauruses have to del uh, deliver the news to this um uh cancer and it is very hard um is it hard or is it very emotional or is it that you are disappointed um and it's as if you tauruses just make the decision abruptly I got to get rid of this um, cancer. I have to get rid of the scorpion. So a lot of you, a transition is coming up for a scorpion and a cancer, okay? And you have to make this decision. Um, you have to carry out this decision. And I see in the third week is when you're going to be telling the scorpion and advising the cancer that their contract is not going to be extended. Now, I see that um, it's as if you Tauruses are trying to save the company a whole lot of money. So be, you know, it's a situation where you're saving yourself and saving your department. You're saving your team. And whatever is transpiring is as if some of you Tauruses was the person who gave the reference and the go ahead to bring in a scorpion or to bring in a cancer and now you're having regrets because i see the energy of death is transition and there is an ending that is coming in for a scorpion now you get to recognize that you can't save everyone and this is a this is a job position this is amount you get you can't save everyone it is a situation where if you think that you can save everyone at the workplace is a situation where you have to choose for yourself because if you don't do it management is going to be asking and finding someone else to carry out your work and this is what is happening and transpiring so it is a situation where um it might not be what you wanted to do 
but it, you have to make this decision and it's a hard decision this harsh communication that i said and harsh communication have to do with when you have to tell someone that we have to let them go so a lot of you and uh, um, whoever this person is, transition is here. And I see a whole lot of, uh, uh, you are, you know, trying to connect and recognize, Hey, you know, I, I gotta do this or else, uh, my neck is going to be on the chopping board. So, you know, this is the decision and this is the direction because I could be on the chopping board next. Now, at the end of this period, the Ten of Pentacles, this is going to be good, good, good. A lot of you could be um, leaving um, a position and um, they're going to be paying you out. And a lot of you are in business is going to be having a good month. At the end of the month, a lot of you are going to be, whoa, okay, wow, okay. Um, so that is good. Transition is going to be coming up where a lot of you... Uh, it's going to be tired, tired. Um, it is going to be a very busy, busy month. So there's no question about this, but I see a lot of you. So you're going to be going hard at, uh, on a cancer. It's as if a lot of you could have uh, given a cancer some sort of a positive, uh, um, reputation to get in a company and recognizing that this cancer has ruined everything and as, uh, um, put you uh, on the blast where you are the one that is now picking up uh, um, the is, is picking up uh, the slack for this person. So it's as if you stand and support someone, give them a chance, and now you're recognizing, oh my God, you're getting information that, hey, you got to get rid of this um cancers because I've been hearing information, having details and information and recognizing uh were you not aware of this? And you Tauruses was like, no, I had no idea. So there is going to be a whole lot of problems that you need to balance out because that is leaving this month, coming into this month, getting some unusual information about um two team workers or colleagues. Um Someone who you had promoted is not um, working out. And it is as if you have to resolve the situation. But the situation is going to be resolved. And you're going to be, you know, bringing back balance in the situation. And I see it's a situation, things that is coming up from the past. Because whatever is transpiring, some of you Tauruses was connected with a scorpion. Okay, whoever the scorpion is, whatever is transpiring. And if you notice, a lot of you Tauruses are going to be dealing with a scorpion and a cancer. But a lot of you scorpions is now, um, Tauruses are now recognizing that, you know, you have, um, give some sort of uh, references, uh, uh, for a cancer and a scorpion and you're now recognizing, um, that they were not able to cope and, uh, perform um their duties okay and 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 you're like taken aback and it's now recognizing jesus um and i would say to you let it go because you know uh, you have done your best uh let it go i see you're going to be trying to balance out some sort of a situation and for business people i see a lot of money uh, is there at the end of the month. So this money is coming in. So it could be a lot of clients, a lot of debts are now going to be paid out and that sort of a thing. A lot of you could be thinking and worried about salary and worried about the costs moving forward with your company. So a whole lot of situation. A lot of you are going to be recognizing that, um, you know, creditors, debitors, some sort of an issue with them are coming back and you're trying to figure out how to balance this out. But at the end of the month, I can tell you there is going to be money and there is going to be a lot of money. Um, your liquid, um, liquid, um, your liquidity is going to be good. Okay. So if you have a business, not to worry, your business is going to be balanced out. Your, you will have enough. 
to pay your debts and credit. Okay, so Taurus says this is absolutely good. It's absolutely wonderful. Um, you have the energy of uh, your sister energy that is ending the month with you, that is bringing balance, that is balancing out issues, situation, problems. Uh, and you are really curving yourself and not... Uh, it's a lot of work. It's going to be a busy month. I can't say anything else. Taurus is going to be an extremely busy month. And it's as if you are moving into this month and you are taking down problems, resolving problems, issues, um, your chaos. There was some sort of a chaos. You're jumping in. You were asked to jump in and resolve this chaos. So Taurus, you're moving through this month because um, you Tauruses at the end, at the two first week, you're moving in and cleansing out things. And like the third week, you have now resolved things because the energy of transition with a tower in reverse. So it's here where you're creating a whole lot of transition in your world and ending things that no longer, um, going with the, the, the frequency of, uh, your department to, uh, or wherever you are, you're the manager or whatever. So here you are, Taurus. It's like you're cleansing things, healing things. If you notice all the, um, the heavy energies, the major energies of the transition is already happening in the second week. And then in the third week, you're finally taking down um, and removing um, certain issues and problems that was there. And at the end of the month, you're standing strong with a ten of pentacles and, you know, feeling your way moving forward. You know, there is going to be some sort of an emotional situation, but yet still you're going to be overcoming that because it's as if, okay, I have to make the decision. The decisions have been made and that's it. I'm not looking um, back at what I've done and I'm not looking forward at what I've done. It needs to be done and I'm doing this and it's going to be happening because at the end of the month, financially you're stable and you're balancing out a whole lot of issues um, that was happening and transpiring. So Taurus is, it is, you know, an, 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 an really successful position that you're going to be standing in. Please remember to follow us to the other side. It is good um, to see what is going to be transpiring. And remember to share, thumbs up, like, shares, and thumbs up. Namaste.